Okay, this is a run. This is run for platform. As you guys see, already see everything about the technology inside. The, oh, sorry. This is the, after you guys see the technology and everything inside. Now we see we focus on the what the business will be. This is the running. In the first half, we think our strength is a uh, look like right now. Many we can see the we can show the, our warehouse or maybe we can call the office building before they rent it. So the customer can come and join us and see, oh yeah, this one is a very good environmental. We have a green technology to provide uh, energy and low cost, of course. So we also use the port leadership. That is the, the green, energy, green technology is a support the port leadership. Yeah, this is the green technology that already support the port leadership. So now we will come into the grow. At this stage, the grow, the grow is a right in the first half. We feel that it, our company is a very big office, so we focus on the small company. That is a, that is which is a small customer. That is an organization that is a little bit small. And then now we can focus on the big company because some of the big company they don't want to invest a lot of money on the small town. So if this one, if our warehouse is in the Philly or small town like this, look like a Starbucks. They not open in the in this town. Why? But we don't know yet. So if they want to open and maybe they can rent our house and it's very low cost because our cost is very low for the rent is low. So they can survey you use our office to be a survey the market first. And after that, yep, this one is low cost survey that I said before. And what will happen next is uh, will be the transform step. The transform step. We think about it in the future, we will become a server system. As we, as you see already see before, we already see that it's a, it's very we have a very good security, very good safe energy. So in our warehouse will be the system for the internet visual world. We can rent look like one office is one server for one company. They can come inside and they don't need to worry too much about the electric will shut down or if flooding or something like that, we will take care of all of this, the national disaster. The second one is, we already know how to build the community. The community, we think about the environment that is green product. In the future, we can build a community system for every for every town, maybe a factory community or town city or many things. That this one is a, will happen after we get more profit and maybe three years later after we invest and in the first product. Okay. And this is the theme for the financial. Very nice. Kevin, can you read this number for me right here? Do you see that? What is that? 4.2 4 .2 years. That is our ex expected break-even year. When we will, after everything said and done, we purchase the warehouse. Thank you, Kevin, by the way. We purchase the warehouse, we purchase the solar panels, we purchase the geothermal, we do the module housing for all the businesses going involved. And if you see on the right, left-hand side, um, these are all speculated numbers from the Ohio Department of Development, what you will get for each one of those. So. On your left, in the total column right here, the $50 million dollars that the builds the business up and running. On the far left-hand side is all the grants and possibly some of the loans we may get in, that may be incorporated with that. This comes up with a total of $48 million. If you see right here, we have rent. And when I said originally that we'll do the overall cost leadership, I wasn't joking. We're gonna do $8 a square foot. If you're looking at regular square footage of a downtown area right now, you're running upwards of $20 to $30 per square foot. I have speculated at 120,000 square feet, each office building will like 1,000 square feet. We will then have 20 module homes, module home businesses in this green echo village community. If you see right here, the cost is eight dollars for rent, times the square footage, times the total, which is 120, we came up with $960,000. I times that again by 12 for 12 months. You'd be collecting every 12 month or every month. You came up with $11 million. So Kevin, what you said, four years was our break-even analysis for this. If you invest in us, after four years, five years, we'll begin to see a massive return on your investment. 
If you have any questions this time, we'd be glad to answer them. My partners and I thank you for your time. So, is there anything we can help you with? Just I'm curious if you're going to put a label on your service, you call yourselves developers or redevelopers or something like that? Basically, it would be the same thing as owning a business, owning a downtown um, skyscraper. You'd be the developer. It would be the landowner, developer, landowner, landlord, and they all kind of cluster the one. Uh, we would therefore be the landlord. We'd have an off um, at the front desk. We'd have an office. You come in. We'd be the leasing agent and make sure that everything goes smoothly and good from there. Obviously, you saw that our um, back in our financial, we're taking into consideration taxes and everything else. So it was very uh, EBIT, more or less, or even for just the tax and loans. So upfront development and continued management. Um, yes, so. Maintenance and other services included in your financials? Of course, we'll take care of all the can, the common area maintenance, um, between all the flat, uh, between all the trees involved and the shrubbery within the, the, the walkways, we'll take care of all that. Heat, cooling? Um, through geo, through uh, geo engineering, geothermal engineering uh, takes care of all the heat. Uh, geothermal engineering is pipelines that go into the earth and keep everything at a constant 50 degrees, 52 degrees Celsius, which is the core of the earth. Um, and through that, we would be able to, um, we don't have to pay a cooling, we might have to pay a cooling bill because it's only 52, and we don't have to pay a heating bill if it ever gets that cold, but everything's at a constant 52. I'm assuming you're targeting large cities. Do you think about which cities you'd start with? Yeah. We have well, we originally were planning on Finley, Ohio. Yeah. Pan is, uh, with his uh, thing about Starbucks. Um, yeah. And we just wanted to get a, a conceptual idea going forth. Um, when we were talking about the, um, the uh, differentiation, we really didn't have a target market in hand at that point. We were just uh, stealing the idea that uh, there's plenty of warehouses to be had for new purchase solar. All right. Well, thank you so much.